Hey guys, welcome back to Tales of the Abyss. In the last part, everybody agreed to the summit, and the replicas invaded Batacle, and one was Falcon Paunched for, um, looking like someone that, yeah, a replica was punched for looking like his original. Yeah. It makes just as much sense as our world does today. Okay, anyway. Scene. I see. So that Largo fellow really is Natalia's true father. Yes, sir. There's no doubt. What to do? That child could very well be forced to battle her own father. Natalia still doesn't know. There's always the option of not telling her at all. Yeah, knowing the truth doesn't always bring happiness. How about you? Luke, what do you think? When I found out I was a replica, I felt like I didn't want to know. I was sad. But I had already begun to get a sense that I wasn't really myself. If I hadn't known, I would have been in complete despair. I'd have just given up on everything. I know her case is completely different, but I think it's probably better to know. I think you're right. Ignorance can be bliss. But the idea of us knowing while Natalia, the one in question here, doesn't. It feels wrong to me. It'll only make it more painful when she finds out later. You're right. Give me some time to think it over. Yes, Your Majesty. I'll use this time to go to Malkuth to suggest the Emperor settle on a policy. I'll be borrowing the Albior. Well then, what's it going to be, Luke? Back to the manor? Yeah. Luke, what's wrong? Yeah, you're acting weird, Luke. Off in your own little world. Ah! Luke! Lorelei? Or is it? Hey, Replica, where are you? Ash! We're in... Never mind, I see it. Bad. Damn it, first you put your voice in my head, now you're looking through my eyes? I'm close to battle. I'll meet you there. Stay in the city. I'll be back in the manor. If you want to come see me there, be my guest. No, head to the port or something. I want to go back to my home. Fine, do what you want. What did Ash have to say? He's coming to meet us. I told him we'd be at the manor. The manor? Are you okay with that? Yeah, it's better this way. Why? I mean, I know I, I already know what's going on because I've already played this game about 50 times, nah, but you guys don't, so I wonder what could be going on. Whatever, anyway. I never thought I'd see you back here. I never thought I'd return. Ash, how is Lorelei? I couldn't make contact. It must be trapped inside Van, unable to communicate. So your search for the Jewel of Lorelei is... Still ongoing, but we do know that Lorelei passed the key up through the Sephiroth. If you didn't pick it up, it should still be somewhere around the Sephiroth. But you searched them, didn't you, Ash? What, did you miss one? I'm not an idiot. You have me confused with someone else here. What are you trying to say? They say the sword and the jewel react to one another. You should have found it. If we don't get the jewel, things play right into Van's hands. Damn. And with the miasma, the people are leaning towards the new order of Lorelei. The miasma? The light of the sacred flame shall approach a Kimlaskan city of phone machines, seeking a way to purify the taint. There, salvation shall be found through the use of a forbidden power.
Ash, what if the miasma could be neutralized through a hyper-resonance? What are you talking about? That's impossible. Not if you have the Sword of Lorelei. It would cost someone their life, but... Luke, what are you talking about? That's the first time I've heard anything like that. So? You saying you'll die for us? I... I'm saying... Must be nice for you replicas, being able to say you'd just give it all up like that. If I could make up for Exeriuth by apologizing, I'd apologize as much as it took. If my dying could bring back Exeriuth, then... I'd be scared. But... I'd die. I don't want to die any more than anyone else. Huh, of course you don't. I... I'm not ready to die yet either. But, but wait! This little chat is over. I've got something to do. I'm not done talking. Just give me ten, five more minutes. But let go of me! Come on, hear him out, Ash. Fine. Ugh. <clears throat> Fine, I'll come with you. I'm whiny. And yes, this is one of the... I believe this is the last time that Ash will ever join us. Let's see how crappy he is. Alright, Luke, 1,700. Oh! Yeah, Ash blows chunks. Okay. Anyway, uh, what do you want to do? Looks like House Fabra has its own issues. I thought Ash was going to be in this one. Not really. Everything would be fine if Ash would stop being stubborn and just come back. What would you do, then? If you're going to start up about how nobody needs you, I'm leaving. I, I don't really know what I'd do. But... Loser. Before you go telling Ash what to do, how about you decide what you're going to do with yourself? <laughs> well, absolutely. If you don't have your own purpose, you can hardly force anyone to do anything else. Oh, wait, anyone else to do anything? Uh, why do all the girls around me have to be so harsh? I love that. But man, where? what do you want? It's the truth, after all. Man, I thought Ash was going to be in that one. Dang it, it was like, oh, replica, what do you want me to do here? Yeah, I want to leave because I'm whiny and stubborn and bleh. Because I'm Ash, the whiny, angsty version of you. Okay, anyway. What you gotta do is you just gotta go into your parents' room. So, yeah. Luke! Luke! Your... Father? Mother? I've brought the real Luke home. You bastard! What are you planning to- We'll be waiting in the courtyard. Luke! It's really you, isn't it, Luke? It- It's good to see you again, Mother. So you've been with the Oracle Knights? Yes. You've grown up, Luke. Father. It, you want Ash to meet up with your parents. But Luke, are you okay with this? The thought of Ash coming here always made you... Terrified. It still does. But I'm just a replica. He's real. If I'm going to get told I'm not needed, I'd rather hear it sooner than... Stop it, Luke. Guy? I thought something was up with you. You've got this stupid idea about killing yourself to stop the miasma, don't you? Luke, don't be an idiot. You keep telling yourself you're just a worthless replica imposter. You keep worrying that you'll be told you're unnecessary. What does that even mean? I've been asking myself ever since I found out I'm a replica. Why was I born? Who am I? 
Why am I alive? I have no right to exist. No replica does. I've heard enough. So have I. I'm not Luke anymore. I'm never coming back here. Get over that inferiority complex before you go proposing anything stupid. You're infuriating! Luke, let's get some rest. You've got to be tired. Yeah. And yeah, Ash was with us for a grand total of about... What was that? 50 seconds, maybe? Something like that? I don't know. Whatever. Hope you enjoyed having him again, because that's the last time you'll ever get to use him. So yeah. It's true that we'd lose the limitless energy provided by phone power. But what good is maintaining the planet storm if all of humanity is lost? The score is no longer our guide. The time has come to shape the future by our own wills. Most phone tech and phonic arts would be lost if the planet storm were gone. But not all phonons would disappear. We simply have to develop a way to make use of those limited phonon resources, correct? Why worry about future inconveniences when we may not have a future at all? I agree that stopping the planet storm is the logical solution. Everyone, good news. We've agreed to stop the planet storm. As have we. Now we should head to Doth for the formal summit. Their Majesties have set sail for Doth already. Yeah, but we're taking the Albior. We'll probably pass them along the way. Okay, let's go. What are you talking about? F that! We got some... We got a side quest to do. Or actually, six. But it's all in one location, so there's nothing to worry about. Um... I think I'll just kinda... Actually, how much money do we have? Oh my gosh, I think we have enough money. Okay, actually, I'm gonna do a different side quest because this is one that needs to get done. Um, this is the single most expensive side quest in the game. And even now, I don't have enough money for it. Yeah. I don't have enough. That just gives you a little bit of a hint of how much money you need to do this. And this will get you two titles, or wait, it'll get you a title for everyone and two for Luke. So anyway, I'm going to come in here and sell a bunch of armor and weapons and charms and stuff, see if I can um, make up that 70,000 gold I need. Let's see here, I will be right back after I sell everything. Okay, I just went, hold, I went ahead and sold everything, and I now have... 1,023,000 gold, alright, so, that's quite a sizable sum, although my uh, main file that I use to just play whenever I want to play for myself, which I haven't played in, like, a month or two, um, wait, is this a scene? Ah, ah I was afraid I'd missed you. What's going on? What are you doing all the way out here? So, you've left the neutralization of the Miasma to Ash? What? Ash came by just a bit ago asking about how to neutralize the Miasma using hyper-resonance. Ash? But why? That jerk. What is he thinking? I did some calculations at his request for the likelihood of that plan succeeding, but... There simply aren't enough seventh phonons to make it work. With Lorelei asleep, there wouldn't be enough even if the planet storm were active. And even if there were enough. No one could endure it. The phonon bonds would break, the phonons would separate, and the person would die. Don't tell me that Ash was fully aware of that. Yes. I tried to stop him, but he was insistent. But what about the 10,000 seventh phonists he'd need to sacrifice? He'll use the replicas. The seventh phonon is used to bond a replica's atomic particles. 
They could be used as a substitute for the seventh phonists. He has the sort of Lorelei to use as an amplifier as well. That idiot! He's planning to kill himself and take all the replicas with him? What the hell is he thinking now, after all that talk about not wanting to die? Luke, you have to stop him! We can't let him do something like this! I know. Where is he now? If he's planning on using the replica seventh phonons, then he's at the Tower of Rem. Where is that? The QB Peninsula. It was part of the Cliffoth, but now it should be at the tip of the Rugnican continent. All right, let's go get Ash. Yeah, I mean, we gotta stop him. I mean, for both probably Luke's guilty conscience and Natalia. But anyway, uh, she said at the tip of the Rugnican continent, but she never said which tip. There are two. Dang it, woman. However, it's at the southern tip. If you can see where I'm aiming, just follow where I'm aiming. It's that island at the southern tip. However, we're not going there right now. We are taking a little detour here, and we're going to go to Sheridan. So see you there. Okay, here we are. Now, this side quest is available after you clear the island of Ferris, but generally, I would imagine that if you didn't continue with your money from a previous playthrough, you won't have enough money to do this by now, unless you just ground for money for days. But anyway, come here after you clear the island and talk to Aston. Alright, so what you got to say? Hello, Aston, how are you doing? Oh, I'm doing fine. A lot has happened, though. Yes, I'm on, okay. Blah, blah, blah. Spoken like true princess. I have an idea. If we th I think if we work together with Belkin, we could accomplish a lot. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, Sheridan and Belkin seem close, but they're separated by water. Going back and forth by ship is a bother. I'm thinking about building a bridge. Alright, yeah, we're going to connect them. And connecting the two cities directly is probably impossible, but if we pick the two closest points of land, it's not that far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, there's a problem. Is there something we can help with? I appreciate the offer, but this is about monies. Gall, monies? You mean you're short on monies, is? We can handle the engineering with no problem, but we're drastically short on monies to cover the materials. Natalia, do you think maybe we could ask Uncle to pay for it? With handling post-war issues, caring for wounded soldiers, housing orphans, and countless other causes, there's no leeway in the treasury. And I plan to devote the, the Natalia fund? She has her own fund? What? Ugh. Okay, whatever. I'll ask Father. Belkin is his tor territory, after all. Luke, there, the area around Sheridan is the ter territory of a different noble, is it not? I don't think it will go over well for the bridge to be in... T yeah, whatever. Ugh. Yeah, yeah, we can fund it ourselves. We'll manage something with our travel fund. Yeah, yeah, okay, we get it. We're gonna pay for it out of our pocket. Okay, we're giving away our monies, yes. Okay, now, have you gathered any monies per chance? Yes, we have. Okay, now, 100, 1,000, 10,000, 100,000, a million. Yikes, yeah, don't do that. Uh, there, there. The system for actually bringing the gold up on screen is really weird, but anyway. And then one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, yeah, that's a million. Oh, it's so sad. Fine, give him a million dollars. We finally finished the funding. Okay. All right, it wasn't just us. Everyone contrib contributed. Haha, uh -huh, yeah. Okay. Oh, my beloved monies. Okay. Oh, okay. Blah, blah, blah. Can we get the title now? Shut up. All right. Have it done the next time you come, okay? Now, let's go ahead and just... You know, I'm going to try the whole Pokemon thing. Can we just walk out of that room and then come back in and it be done, or we need to leave the city? Let's see. And yeah, I know this video has been going on for quite a while, but right after this is done. Okay. Looks like we're going to leave the whole city. Blah, blah, blah. It's annoying. Come on, you guys build slow. And then the bridge, it actually appears on the world map. It's actually quite sizable. So, yeah, I'll be showing that um, once this is done, too. So, anyway, let's go back in Sheridan. And oh, I want to finish this. Most expensive side quest in the game cost you one million gold, or monies, whatever you want to call them. Cost you a, mil a million zenny. Ugh, such a stupid name for money. Whatever, anyway. Okay. Oh! Whatever. Okay, you know what? In the next part, we're gonna do stuff. So anyway, see you guys later.